Hi everybody, welcome back. Sip City, San Francisco. We're in San Francisco. Uh, we just left last episode. Uh, we added another uh, pump to this water pumping station because we have a little bit of a deficit in Sip City. Uh, everything was running out of water, uh, although we placed a hospital and stuff, so hopefully we can start cleaning up some germs and stuff. Population over here is growing. Uh, our hourly income is also growing. The density of this area is going to start increasing gradually as we flick in between each city. Uh, let's head over to Sip City and see if this, uh, if this water situation is resolved yet. That would be very good. Um, as I was saying last episode, water problems are just the absolute worst. You don't want to be in a situation where you're without water. And if, especially if it takes a long time to get water pumping back through the city, uh, you can really cripple like a lot of your industries and stuff like that. It's a, uh, it's just a bad situation. Okay. Let's, uh, put it on llama speed and see where we're at. We still got a deficit. Uh, hopefully the regional update uh, soon and oh look it, it seems to be already I hope I hope that's just the region updating still got a little bit of a deficit 16.3 kilogallons missing oh my god I don't know if we're gonna need to get another pump or not let's uh, we'll give it some time anyway and we'll see it's definitely made a little bit of a, a difference uh, we shut down this oil well last time we were here uh, because there's basically... Um, oh, look at this. Okay, water has taken now, I think. 16.3 uh, still. I just saw the message up there. Uh, it doesn't look like it's quite met the needs, uh, but we'll have to see. Oh, look, the, the deficit's still going down. I think as the water starts touching some of the places that were out of water, it's, it's, it's adding to the deficit. We'll have to keep an eye on that. We might need another pump. God damn it. Imagine there's like five pumps in, in San Francisco. How many pumps do we need? Not too many, I hope. Okay, uh, shopping is available in San Francisco. You can see, like, every time we get into the city, basically, the, the region uh, starts to update. And, oh, God, this is for sale. What the hell? Is it because of the hospital? Which is treating three patients? I don't know. Um, we should have these, like, germ people going around and curing germs as well. Hopefully that's happening. I hope that's like a thing. Uh, this has been closed down. We can probably tear this down now and start planting some trees and, and, and mopping up some of the uh, pollution that we caused here. Look at all the homeless people in Sip City. My God. Just uh, pretend they're not there. It's, it's a little bit embarrassing. I didn't realize that we had so many homeless people. That's, that's just pretty awful. Um, We'll clear all this up as well. Uh, look at this. This is great. It's nice to get rid of these, actually. We've pumped all of the oil out of the ground now. Uh, we haven't had to import any. We'll get to a point where we will need to import some. Let's get rid of this road here, too. We'll keep it attached to, to this depot. We'll still hang on to this depot while these two are working. Um, but once they're done, once they've pumped everything out, I think... Oh God, I think these are almost pumped out. Look at this. Crude oil under building two months supply and one month supply. Do you know what? I think we can get rid of all of these. It means, though, that we're going to have to start importing uh, oil. We don't really want to start doing that yet. Uh, we can definitely turn these off, though. Uh, and if we need to, we'll turn them back on. Uh, we'll turn them off and start looking at some of this pollution, hopefully. Oh, look at this. We've got some money back, uh, which is very good, uh, just from turning those off. Let's uh, plant some trees around here, start sucking up some of this pollution. Oh, look at this. These trees are just going to die, like, instantly, because it's just so unbelievably polluted around here. <laughs> it's really bad. God, this the industry has really ravaged this center bit of the city. Uh, it'll be nice, though. Eventually, when it's all cleaned up, we can expand into this, build some nice uh, residential and commercial areas, some landmarks and stuff. Uh, Sip City is going to be fantastic. Holy shit. It, it keeps getting better as well. It's got to be set. Uh, deficit. Uh, some, some buildings still need water. It looks like we're still working on a deficit. We might have to go head back over to San Francisco, see if that updates. Uh, but we'll leave it just for a little bit, just to make sure that uh, it's not going to like update and, uh, and cover everything that we need. We'll probably head over to Sipsville again in a minute as well. Uh, let's see, health. Uh, are there still a lot of people walking around constipated? There seems to be. Uh, although our coverage is much better now, uh, we should be getting to people. How's this place doing? This is at capacity. Holy shit. 
These people need to go to the hospital instead. Ah, oh, which is, of course, closed because there's no water. God damn it. Jesus. Okay, if this water situation doesn't solve itself in like two seconds, we're going to head back. We'll head to Sipsville first, and then we'll go over to San Francisco. I think we've done everything that we can do in uh, in Sip City for now anyway. How are we doing here? Producing fuel and plastic? Fine. Uh, we need to start importing uh, oil. Uh, crude oil so that we can still make our profit. So let's do that. We're going to import for 9,000 bucks per thousand. That's pretty cheap actually. Um, get this all filled up again and start using it locally. Of course, we need crude oil for uh, Big Bastard, which is powering the entire region at the moment. Uh, we also want to make sure that uh, the oil refinery is able to produce fuel and plastic and ship it out uh, and use it for our, our processors too. We should have a lot of plastic. I don't know about alloys. How are we doing for alloys? We've got 10 tons of alloy left. And we have 4,000 crates of plastic. Holy shit. We can maybe offload some of this. We seem to be creating a lot of plastic. I think we are selling. Oh, no, we're not. We're just using it locally. We do not need to be using this much plastic locally. Let's start exporting some of it for some money just to make up for the fact that we're no longer um, making this oil and having to import it. Uh, that should offset uh, the, the price of that. Plastic we're, sh we're making from the oil refinery. We're also uh, just naturally making plastic through recycling. Uh, we can send our recycling trucks over to San Francisco soon too and get even more recyclables. We can expand this all out. It'll be very good. Um, okay, let's get out of here. Uh, deficit just before we go. Minus 16 still. That seems fairly consistent. Uh, let's head into Sipsville, see what's happening, and then we can go over to San Francisco. My god. I'm sorry about all the jumping around, but this is what happens when you decide to play in a region by yourself and set up like 20 cities. <laughs> I prefer playing this way. I, I gotta be honest. This is, for me, this is the ideal. Uh, okay, Llama Speed. Oh, look at Sipsville. It's very refreshing, actually. There's no, there's no problems in this city. It's just all straight up industrial. Look at this. How's our um, coverage? Bus coverage is very good. Great. Uh, how are we doing with... All this stuff. Oh, look at this. 11.2 excess. Um, we've got 371,303 bucks plus 1,614 bucks uh, per hour. We can maybe think about uh, moving the sewage treatment out to here uh, and take it out of uh, Sip City because uh, there'll be tons of room for it to expand here. Um, before we do that, though, let's uh, let's start specializing in some ores because we can make a lot of money off that uh, and it doesn't matter we don't mind polluting this whole area so uh it should be good we'll go into mining uh where is it ore mine twenty two thousand five hundred bucks to place and 125 bucks an hour look we can make an absolute ton of money off this it's gonna be great uh let's uh get a we'll get an intersection here an avenue intersection here uh which should be fine we can just have that go all the way up here and then, I think, uh, how's, do we have, no, okay. We can start exporting, we can get the trade port and hook it up to the rail. That's going to be fantastic. Okay, great. Um, shit, I did not mean to press that button. That always scares me. <laughs> Just like this massive zoom out. Uh, okay, we need to see where all the ore is so that we don't build a road right over uh, some of the important bits like, uh, like I almost just did. Fine, okay. Uh, let's get this medium density street uh, down right at the end here. And then we'll have it sort of like go like this. And then we can place our first ore collector like on top of there. And that'll be fine. Okay, great. Uh, ore then, ore mine. Oh man, look at this. 285 tons of ore coming out of this big bastard. That's fantastic. Holy shit, that is so good. Uh, make mine mine. There could be a fortune in raw ore just waiting to be dug up. Is metals mining the future for Sipsville? Well, I don't know if it's the future, but we'll definitely make uh, a good chunk of cash off of it. It'll be very good. Uh, let's build another road uh, across the way here so that we can start uh, stockpiling some of this stuff and uh, looking to sell it or maybe shipping it into, um, whatchamacallit, uh, Sip City so that we can make some alloys. That would be very good. Uh, so, we want a trade depot. We can probably take this off for now. We'll just start with one. Uh, here we go. Trade depot. Let's get this set up right on the edge here. And we want to edit it straight away and put a sign on here, of course. The most important part of any building that you place in Sip City. Always the sign. 
Uh, let's get rid of this. We don't want this uh, freight shipping warehouse because we've got another trade depot uh, for that. Uh, we want a raw ore storage lot. Uh, in fact, we probably want, what, like two raw ore storage slots? Great. Fantastic. Look at that. Very good. Perfect. Okay. Uh, we're in business. We can add a sign onto this as well. Uh, wherever it goes, I can't remember. Oh, look, right on the top. Oh, that's so cool. Look at that. Auga. <laughs> we're in business. Mining operation. Uh, we can make some more ore delivery trucks. Uh, we probably have one already, which is enough. And we can expand this four times with different ore shafts. Look at that. Production rate, 24 tons a day. I think the base rate of this is 24 tons a day as well. So we can just start with that. We'll let some people come and work here and we can start... Uh, what do we want to do with this ore? We can export it for 7,500 per 10, or we can just hang on to it, I think. Let's just hang on to it for now, and then we can think about exporting it all in one go, or potentially, um, if there's some way that we can make it into alloys and send it over to Sip City for the processor manufacturing, that would be fantastic. Uh, I'm not sure if we can yet, though. I, I, don't, I don't think I've ever built one of these before, actually, an ore mine. I'm, I'm usually an oil guy. I usually like to build like oil facilities, petro, petro facilities. That, that's usually my thing. Okay, so we're still doing very well with money per hour. Uh, we're still got a lot of money to spare as well. Let's uh, let's get this sewage treatment plant up and running uh, if we can. We'll expand this uh, avenue down here right to the edge. Great. Uh, and if we get another medium density street in, let's get it in here. Because uh, if we're going to treat a lot of sewage, it's going to be a really big facility. So if it takes up this whole area, so be it. Great. Okay. Uh, sewage. Let's go to the sewage treatment plant here. Uh, 64000 bucks to put down and uh, 400 bucks an hour. We can totally afford that. Let's get this so that we can place stuff on either side and then just expand it out as much as we need to. I believe there's four cylinders already in the uh, Sip City one. So we're going to have to start with at least four. Uh, so that we can start accepting from the region. So let's just go for it. Uh, I mean, we've got the money. We might as well. Look, we'll get them on this side as well. Look at this. Four big ones. Great. Uh, our excess is 239.3 an hour. <laughs> that is absolutely nuts. Uh, we can shut this one down. Yeah. Get, get out of here. Uh, we can knock it down too. It's right next to Town Hall. Not not the best place, but uh, I'm, I'm sure we covered that last time uh, when I placed it. Is this thing operational yet? No, it's still hiring. Uh, so the, the poop actually has nowhere to go at the moment. <laughs> Let's turn this back on for a minute until this one's up and running. God damn it. That poop was just sitting there and it was about to explode. Can you imagine that? Like an entire earthquake in the city caused by just like a really big buildup of poop with nowhere to go because that's what happens. Poop is fairly explosive. Like if you don't deal with poop straight away and it's just sitting around, it will blow up. Trust me, I, I know about these things. Um, I think this is like at capacity. Look at this. Why is it complaining? Oh no, I think that's uh, saying that there's pollution. God damn it. <laughs> we need employees. Look at this, I'm gonna go on cheetah speed. Look, full speed ahead until we actually get this thing up and running. That'll be great. Uh, has this hired yet? No. No. Where Where are all the people? Oh, look at these freight shipments are making huge profits. Okay, great. Are, are all these... Oh, no, look. Need workers at all these places. Do we just have, like, some demand for low wealth? Yeah, we do. I wonder if... Oh. No? Sip City's dump vol... Oh, that's another thing we need to do. We need to build the dump here. Get it out of Sip City. Uh, we can probably afford to do that pretty soon actually if we can turn this bastard off uh, and get some people working here that would be great I'm on cheetah speed so I'm just waiting for it all to take it might not take we might have to come back sometimes with the regions it's a little bit funny when you're working with like multiple cities and stuff uh, it you, you sometimes have to jump between the cities a couple of times just to get like changes to update I guess to the server and start taking uh, okay, well, we're buying water from San Francisco. It looks like it's doing something with the region at the moment because all these little messages are coming in. So we'll just give it a couple of minutes. And if not, jump over to San Francisco, add another pump to the water pump, uh, and then we can come back and see if it's made a difference. We'll just give it a couple of minutes. Is there anything else that we need to do here while we're here, uh, while I'm thinking about it? I don't think so. I think, uh, I think we're okay. We could think about getting the garbage dump maybe set up over here. Uh, 
it's 300 bucks an hour, so we're gonna be uh, sort of eating into this and, and getting close to the line. Uh, how are we doing with this bond as well? Let's, oh, we should repay this bond actually. It'll give us some money back per hour and we can totally afford to repay it. We've done it. We've just paid it back. There we go. Uh, great. We're back up to 549 an hour, and we've taken a little bit of a hit on the coffers, but not to worry. Sip City has, uh, more than enough money to, to bail us out again if we need it. Uh, anyone? No? No, nobody wants to work here. <laughs> Big sewage treatment plant opens up. Like, uh, probably one of the best jobs you could ever work at. Just watching, like, shit get treated in, like, a big tank. Nobody wants to work here. God damn it. Okay, uh, we'll, uh, we'll head over to San Francisco, and then we'll see if... Oh, no, look. Oh, no, they didn't turn down here. Look, I was so hopeful. Uh, we'll head over there, and we'll head back and see if it takes. And uh, and that's probably the way to do it. We definitely need a water pump over there anyway, so let's do it. San Francisco. Oh, look at this. We still got, what, two? Yeah, there's still two more places for cities. And then this great works as well. Oh, look at this. We need to get some of these approved. Look at this. Space Center. International Airport. Oh, my God. Look at this. Holy shit. Look at this thing. Construction of the International Airport requires resources and workers from cities in the region. Once open, the International Airport brings flights of tourists into the region and ships freight on cargo planes. Or this. Look at this solar farm. Holy crap. We could totally build this arcology. Building this towering pinnacle of human architecture requires skilled workers and resources. This dense ecosystem contains everything necessary to sustain a massive community. Wow. Sims live here, but many of them will commute to cities in the region to work, go to school, or shop. God, that is fantastic. Look what you need, though. We need 2,800 tons of metal, <laughs> 1,000 tons of alloy, and uh, 60,000 crates of TVs, because everybody wants to, like, uh, watch TV in, in, in the arcology. Let's unlock some of these other ones, and then, um, oh, like, like, Space Center, and then we can make a decision on which one we want to build. I think that'll be good. Uh, okay, uh, back to the region, back over to San Francisco, got a little bit little bit detracted there uh it does happen from time to time my god if you watch me play skyrim uh you're probably like so frustrated with me because i basically have the attention span of like a squirrel <laughs> i can probably focus on something for about a minute and then i'm like on to the next thing like something shinier uh, takes takes my attention and, and and that's what i want to look at it's just the way that goes unfortunately all right uh water pump Come on, you big bastard. We need more water. God, we're almost maxed out on this pump. Can you believe it? Uh, let's grab some water from... Is this... Oh, look it. We get more here. Do we want to get more here? Oh, yeah, look at this. Place it sideways? Should we place it? No, there's not much difference. Let's place it back here so that it's a little bit more compact. Because we don't want this thing sprawling out like all the way over here. Because uh, we can maybe make some like nice houses and shit over here. How's San Francisco doing? I can't remember. <laughs> this is the last time we were here. This comes back to me having the attention span of a squirrel. What the hell were we doing last time we were even here? Oh, look at all these hordes of people, like, walking around on the streets. God damn it. Why Why is this city just home to such morose bastards? That's what I want to know. Uh, looks like the Mendozas just gave up. Low land value, apparently. That park was, like, sorely needed. I mean, we could... Oh, fuck, we could build a park. Jesus Christ, Mendozas, I hate you. I hate you so bad. Um, park. They want, I guess, what? Like a fountain plaza? Can we build this fountain plaza? Like, maybe, like, right here? Just, just for the benefit of the Mendozas? Alright, there you go, you bastards. Take that. Move back in, somebody. Uh, that's just abandoned, not even for sale. So I think we gotta knock this bastard down with this. <laughs> See you in hell, suckers. Uh, what about this one? Abandoned building caused no shoppers. What the hell? What the hell is happening in San Francisco? God, it's making me very, very, very angry. Okay, uh, our excess is up to 504.1. Uh, that should be more than enough to cover that deficit that was uh, in Sip City and also uh, be enough to cover whatever was in uh, required in Sipsville. Let's uh, let's see if that's worked in Sip City. Uh, actually, let's just give it a minute. Is there anything else that we need to do while we're here? I'm gonna be saying this a lot now. <laughs> Every time we jump between cities, uh, are we doing everything that we could possibly be doing? Uh, it looks like we could use a, another expansion to the primary school. Uh, I kind of regret building that primary school actually because I could have built a high school because uh, I had to build one in Sip City. I think a high school would be very good in uh, San Francisco. 
Uh, I'm quite tempted to actually turn off the grade school and replace it with a high school. Uh, it's only 60,000 to place and it costs 1,100 uh, an hour to support. And look at that, 800 desks. That would uh, more than account for everybody uh, in, in the city. Let's do it. Let's shut this fucker down. Go home, kids. <laughs> We're shutting down. We're building a high school. <laughs> oh, poor kids. God damn it. Okay, high school then. Where the hell do we want to place this bastard? Uh, maybe like right beside the elementary school along this avenue. I think that'll work. Pow! There we go. Because we're going to tear this thing down eventually anyway. Look, closed by mayor. Just in case you were ever under any false illusions, it was indeed me who closed it. Oh god, there's probably a big sign plastered across the front of the building. The mayor closed us. Everybody hates me now. God damn it. Okay, great. Uh, so, how are we doing? High school is closed and now hiring. Look at all these buses are like coming back, returning to base. A little bit of a waste of money there, but uh, it doesn't matter. We, we've got money to burn. Let's let's knock this fucker down. Here we go. See you later, grade school. We don't need a grade school. We're, we want a high school. God, just look at this. This thing is just going to be the epicenter of bullying. Holy shit. So many kids are going to leave here crying every day. High school. God, uh, for a lot of people, probably like the worst point in their entire lives. Um, you know, it... It, it, it does go that way sometimes. I mean, high school can be fun, depending on what kind of person you are. Maybe you like to learn. Uh, maybe you like to um, stand outside your school and, and smoke uh, cigarettes in front of your teachers. It just depends on, <laughs> on your personality entirely. God damn it. I hope nobody's standing out front of this high school and smoking in front of the teachers. I would be absolutely appalled. Um, are we teaching anyone yet? No. It's uh, it's 8.15 p.m., uh, generally not the time when people are attending high school, so we'll have to wait until tomorrow morning. Um, that's got enough capacity to cover the entire city for now anyway. Uh, when's our next upgrade? 14,995 residents. That's fine. I don't think we even need anything else. Tourism? I think, it, I think it's only tourism that we're missing now, the Department of Tourism for the whole region. And, of course, once we get the airport, we can get the uh, helicopter landing pad as well. Holy shit, that's going to be fantastic. All right, let's jump over to Sip City then and see uh, if that water's taken. God damn it. God damn you, water. Look at this. Holy shit, 18 million cities have been founded. I, I don't know how accurate that is. Is that is that a lie? Do you guys know? Do you know if this is just like a big red face lie? Because, like, you always have a red face when you tell a lie. That's why I say red face lie. Um... Okay, water deficit, 16. Uh, is it going to change? Oh, yes. Okay, great. San Francisco is just such a paradise. Look at that. It's fantastic. Okay, everything should be up and running now then. Uh, we should be doing good. Uh, I know that we're still in the hole, but we managed to close down all of these oil wells. And in fact, uh, now that they're closed down and we've started importing this oil, uh, we can just knock these things down. See you later, oil wells. That's right. Whoever was working here can go work in Sipsville now. God, what a sad day. It's a little bit of a sad day. I mean, we always had a lot of oil wells pumping uh, all day and night in the city, and uh, and now we don't. And of course, the uh, the poor residents and, and people being treated in the hospital no longer have this stunning view of uh, mass industry anymore. Sip City is like slowly starting to clean up. It's kind of nuts, actually. It's bringing a bit of a tear uh, to my eye. I gotta say. Well, I'm just joking, actually. It's not really. Here we go. We're gonna put a lot of trees down here. And we're gonna hope that these trees can suck up all this ground pollution. Uh, we're gonna add some more over here. Look at this. They just keep going down. Jeez, it's really bad. Uh, I think we're probably past the point of needing this thing as well. And, uh, oh my god, I completely forgot about this stupid park and ride. I mean, I, I probably said, like, about 10 years ago that I was going to knock this thing down, and I forgot to do it. All right, parking ride, get out of here. Get out of here, water pumping station as well. We don't need you anymore. Uh, we're done. In fact, oh, this trade depot, uh, that's a lot of oil. Uh, a lot of oil coming to that trade depot. What's going in here? Is this just all alloys? It is, yeah. Okay, great. Uh, we don't need this many alloy warehouses because we don't have that much alloy in the city as it stands. So, we're going to knock down two of these and replace them with crude oil tanks. Here we go. Crude oil. One and two. Perfecto. There we go. Uh, we need to import oil here. 
as well. Uh, so import the crude oil. Fine. Use that locally. That's fine. Okay. Great. And we want to stop importing crude oil here. Empty it all out. We're going to use it locally. Uh, and then once it's emptied out, we can get rid of this road. We can get rid of this trade depot and start cleaning this area up and then we can use it oh my god this is fucking exciting actually this is very very exciting how are we doing uh with our mass transit in here i'm getting into the swing of things now uh buses 53 minute average wait that's terrible uh, unfortunately streetcars 45 minutes it's gone down oh that's really good Trains, we don't have a train yet. Oh, we could really do with a train. Holy shit, we could do with a train. I think a train would be very good to connect up to San Francisco, also to Sipsville. Uh, I think it's gonna, I think it's gonna be the future actually. And look, we can build a train station like just in here. The track is like right here. Fantastic, oh my God, did you see that big plane just flew by? Uh, okay, great. Well, hopefully we can burn through all of this oil. Uh, an actual fact, let's not uh, import any oil here either so that we can burn through it and then when we're out we'll re-enable the importing on here so that we can clear out all this stuff we need to clear all this stuff out and then we can get rid of that trade depot okay fantastic what's this is this the shuttle bus yeah what about the regional buses how many buses do we have we only have three municipal buses oh that is terrible oh we could do so much better oh we can do way better okay fine we're gonna add a couple of these how much are these uh I don't even think I placed the sign here. Oh my lord, look, it's like the Greyhound sign, but it's like a rabbit. Oh, fantastic. Let's put it like right up on the top here. Boom! Oh, it's at the back. Okay, fine. <laughs> That's not the best, actually. I don't want it there. Look, you can actually use the little bulldozer and just knock down the sign. That's hilarious. Okay, limit has no longer been reached. Um, uh, whoa! What happened there? Did the sign actually just fall down and destroy a bus? <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Uh, let's get the sign, like, in the front here. Or on the side. Do you want it on the side? Oh, that looks fucking cool. Yeah, that definitely. That looks really cool. What a great place to put a sign. Because there's already this, like, fake sign here that I wasn't able to place. Okay, great. I love editing these buildings. This is fantastic. Okay, 15,000 bucks and 250 an hour. Let's get two of these. Great. Expand this out. We get... So we get six extra buses on top of the three that we already have. That should bring the wait time down a little bit. Uh, we need more buses for this bus terminal because this is the one that's um, sending people out to San Francisco and Sipsville. So very important. God damn it. That's really good. Let's check out this ground pollution now to you and just see. I don't think it's made a different yet, a difference yet. But oh my god, look at that. It's almost completely cleared up. And look at that. That little shit stain, uh, well, it was a really big shit stain, but it's, it's really going down. Those trees are really getting to work on all this. This is really, really good. Look at all these people. I like, just got pranked big time. They're just like stepping through all this shit and look at, the, oh, look at this big one. That's going to take forever to clean up. It's fine, though. Once it's all cleaned up, we don't need to worry about germs and stuff. It's going to be great. Uh, on the topic of germs, how are we doing? Uh, there's still a couple of constipated people, but far less than there were, so obviously the hospital is actually doing something useful. Uh, it's all thanks to this thing, too. How many sicknesses have been treated? Four a day. We've got four ambulances here. Oh, God, that is fantastic. Holy shit, that is so good. Uh, we can probably volunteer uh, an ambulance out to Sipsville, uh, because Sipsville, I don't think, is going to have a clinic or an ambulance. Let's quickly do that. Uh, so, we want to go health look at that we got whoa what is that oh it's the wellness fan <laughs> look at that that's fantastic holy shit it's like an rv with like a heart painted on the side of it that's so good uh okay we want to uh offer one ambulance out here i think that's all we need we just need one ambulance to head out to sipsville every once in a while and help out if anybody gets hurt uh and that should be fine okay great fine one ambulance it is let's go back to the city Jesus Christ. Ah, this has been good. This has worked out really well. Look, we've solved, like, almost all the problems. We're, like, massively back in the hole as well. But not for long. We won't be in the hole for too long. Uh, what did we want to do here again? We wanted to expand this at some point, didn't we? The trade ed headquarters. Metals division. Oh, yeah. We haven't decided which one we're going to go for yet. Did I ask you guys to vote on these? 
Uh, I'll, I'll keep checking. I can never remember which episode I ask you guys to vote in, so I have to go back and check all the comments and stuff. Uh, if I mentioned it before, I'll mention it again. Uh, let me know which one you think we should build, and, uh, and we can look into building it. Fine. Okay. One last thing to do before we wrap up. We need to go back to Sipsville and make sure that uh, that sewage treatment plant comes online. We spent a lot of money on it. Uh, it's got four cylinders. This is nowhere near capacity, so we'll be able to shut this mother down, uh, save ourselves a thousand bucks an hour, and uh, offset that against Sipsville instead. I think that's very good. Okay, great. Sipsville it is then. We're heading back over here. Look at this. God, I love jumping in between cities. It's a lot more to manage, but God, it's a lot more fun. I find it I find it a lot of fun managing three separate cities, even though I'm pretty dumb and I always forget what's happening in each one. Uh, that's not the point. It is it is still fun. Oh, yeah, I forgot that we set up all this shit as well. Fantastic. Okay, great. Uh, Llama Speed it is then. Uh, have people come to work here yet? I hope so. They might need a bus stop. Maybe they want a bus stop. Look, maybe they just need to, to take a bus to work. Maybe these people want to take a bus up here as well. And up here, too. You never know. We might as well. Okay, great. Uh, anyone? No? Closed? Are, are you closed still? Yeah, still closed. Fine. There's a couple of moving vans uh, heading back. Well, maybe some people moved in into Sip City and are now like thinking about coming down here. Uh, oh, here we go. We've got 519 an hour. Is that enough to place the dump yet? We've got 116,000. We could probably send some more money over from Sip City uh, eventually as well. Oh, look at that. Sip City's ambulance races to the rescue. Where? Is somebody hurt? Oh, no. Oh, say it ain't so. Oh, oh, jeez. Uh, okay, so it doesn't look like this is taking still. God damn it. Is, is it just because we're like, we don't have enough people? Like, oh, look, all these people. Oh, my God. All these places need workers. I can't believe it. Uh, we need to check the region and see if we're getting uh, some workers. Workers. Oh, look. All of our workers are coming over from San Francisco. <laughs> What's it saying here? Workers advise. San Francisco needs high wealth workers. Improve your residential land value and workers will commute to San Francisco. I don't want them to commute to San Francisco. I want them to commute over here. And it looks like they are actually um, commuting there. Low wealth or <laughs> low wealth or low wealth workers map. Uh, oh my God! It's because oh look at all the to the low wealth jobs. Holy shit! That is absolutely nuts. Uh, so we have total low wealth workers. We have a ton of them in uh, Sip City, uh, but we actually have more demand then we have workers. Okay, so maybe that's the problem then. Maybe we need to knock down some more low wealth jobs in Sip City so that we can take some of the low wealth workers out of Sip City. Well, that makes sense. Okay, let's quickly go do that then. Uh, and then we'll see, we'll come back and see if it's done it. So this episode might be a little tiny bit longer than it needs to be, but it makes sense to figure this out now uh, while it's fresh in my mind <laughs> before I forget to do it and it takes me like 10 episodes to catch up with it again. Okay, so we want to see then uh, low wealth jobs. Okay, so that should be land value map. Uh, are all of these low wealth jobs considered low wealth jobs? Te at tech level 2? I wouldn't have thought so necessarily, but industry generally is uh, low wealth, isn't it? And I guess there's going to be some low wealth commercial as well. Uh, let's see. Where's the low wealth commercial, if any? Uh, oh, yeah. There's a whole bunch of low wealth commercial here. Okay. Let's upgrade this to medium wealth then. And that should possibly get rid of some of the jobs. Okay. Uh, we'll go in here. Uh, let's go for nature. And let's just get like a really big park. Like right here. And that should be fine. Help this area out a little bit. God, it's like right next to this oil refinery in this trade depot as well, which is going to have like a bit of a negative effect, but that's okay. Uh, how are these? Okay, so these are sort of heading into medium wealth, I think. Uh, they should be okay for medium wealth. Oh, yeah, see, they're, they're just sort of climbing into them. Okay, fine. Uh, we can also expand this out into the middle a little bit, uh, like with one of these, like a short tree row. Let's do something like this. This should be fine. Just to get some good coverage here. Okay, great. All right, fantastic. Uh, we can ca we can come out of here, and we want to see wealth. Ma oh, okay, great. Look at that. Oh, so actually, the hospital is a positive influencer, but the bus terminal is a negative. Uh, but the the bus terminal here will be very good for the um, 
Look, Hagen's tax preparation has made its return. <laughs> and Superior Com is back too. Fantastic. Okay. Uh, so, low wealth jobs have been obliterated in this area, except for maybe a couple here. Uh, industry? Oh my god, Jesus Christ. Look at that. Look at our budget. It's like so bad. Uh, it's good though. I mean, we'll be able to shut this bastard down eventually. What's this? Agricorp? These are all, uh, what, level 2 industry, are they? Yeah, they are. Okay, let's see. What do we got here? Let's get rid of some of this. We'll get rid of some of this crappy industry uh, and uh, and see if that makes a difference. Move some of the low wealth workers out of the city. That'd be nice. And then we can try to like tidy up this area eventually as well. Okay, we don't want to knock that over. We do want to knock all this over though. What's all this crap? Look at all these little crappy industry places. Uh, and what about uh, around here too? There's this trade depot here we've got custom machined machines <laughs> which we don't need dice die cutting i don't even know why this is along this avenue this can go uh we can get rid of this fine get out of here uh that hopefully will get rid of some more uh low income jo oh my god look at all these abandoned buildings holy shit it's so bad i have to knock some of these down it's out of money look at all the homeless people <laughs> oh my god it's good that we have the industry set up in Sips, uh, Sipsville so that some of these people can start commuting over there and, and making some more money. Because I think the way Sip City is going now with medium and high wealth, uh, a lot of the low income uh, people are, are losing out. They're losing money and becoming unhappy. And actually that probably makes sense with the overall uh, residential happiness. Oh, look at that. Low wealth. People keep dying and we need money. Yeah, so that's absolutely right. We probably touched on that a couple of episodes ago. Okay, uh, that's fine. I think we could probably leave there for now then. We've gotten rid of some, uh, some of the jobs in Sip City for low wealth. We're going to try to farm out low wealth jobs to Sipsville, uh, which I think at the moment makes sense. Uh, it hasn't done much for us on, on an hourly basis, but we're exporting enough to, to make up for it uh, with our processors, our plastics, and our fuel. Um, oh my god, Jesus. Let's just check on this pollution very quickly. Has it made a difference? My god, it's almost all gone there. Except, well, this is just going to take forever. Let's just quickly play some trees, uh, and then I can wrap up there. Look at it. It's so bad. The pollution just eats up all those trees, like, straight away. Here we go. Come on, you big bastard. You big shit stain. Get out of here. We don't want a big shit stain in our city. Oh, is this empty as well? We could save a little bit more money here as well. Is there any... Okay, there's nothing. Great. Shut that down claim some money back and we can resume uh oh no it's not this one it was this one we can start uh importing uh crude oil again there great and using it locally great okay let's knock this down good and let's get rid of this road as well oh my god uh it's all coming together it is really no <laughs> i did not want to do that uh, just as I say it's all coming together, I just like knocked out a massive part of the highway. That's really, f well, I was going to say fantastic, but no, it's not fantastic at all. Um, okay, Sip City is in relative uh, good shape. Uh, we'll head back over to Sipsville after and see if uh, any of these changes have taken. And, uh, and we'll be able to pick up there next time. As usual, thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you next time.